to use the rent. That second garage is used to be so this, garage. So this is a line yeah. of garages? Yeah, so I spoke to the owners to see whether they'd be interested in, in selling the plot for, yeah. uh, for me to put a house on. What made you want to build your own house in the first place? Obviously the age I am, I don't really have many dependents, so I thought if I'm going to do it, if I'm going to do it, I might as well do it now. It's going to be a, a, hopefully a family home. And a, yeah, I mean, I'm not, I'm not really thinking about that as yet, but I didn't want to just build a small house where I wanted to, you know, if I had a family that I'm going to move out in three years. This is a map challenge for anyone. Martin does have some building experience, but never on a budget this tight. Are you going to get your hands dirty? What's, what's the idea? Yeah, I'm hoping to do as much as I possibly can because if I subcontracted the whole build out, you know, there's no way I could afford it. I'm just going to crack on and just try it. With no spare cash, Martin's enlisted the help of an architect friend to draw up plans to his specifications. But what Martin has come up with is extremely ambitious. On the ground floor, a small entrance hall opens into a huge lounge diner. While at the other end of the very large building, space is given over to a carport 